Hey everyone, today we are talking A-B testing with TubeBuddy and I have a special helper who's gonna talk all about A-B testing. Aren't you, are you ready? Let's do this. A-B testing is like trying to pick your favorite puppy. Honestly, it's hard, they're both so cute. You get invested and so sometimes you just gotta leave it up to data. So I'm gonna jump into a computer and show you my screen so I can share with you how I did A-B testing and what the results were. All right, so we're gonna to go to TubeBuddy. We're gonna do our very first A-B testing with a thumbnail. First thing we're gonna do, sign in. We're gonna go to my channel and then what we're gonna do is go click on this A-B test. We're gonna create an A-B test. So we have the most recent upload here and we're gonna run a thumbnail CTR test. So we are going to click this one. We're gonna set this for a couple of weeks. And we'll go ahead and continue. And then here is the updated thumbnail that I'm going to test it against. There we go, so this is gonna be thumbnail A. This is gonna be thumbnail B. So obviously this one has my face in it. This one just has my usual template on it. So this one is more simple, but it does have my face, so we're gonna see if this, let's see, makes a difference. So we're gonna hit yes, we're gonna start the test. So then we'll have initial results on Friday. So we need um, a good week of data for it to kind of figure out which one it's going to do. So I'll come back and I'll show you what this looks like um, in the results. And actually I can show you one, let's see here. So there's an old one that's already been completed. This is the information that you're gonna see. You're gonna see the original click-through rate and then like the variation. And so here are the two thumbnails that I created. And it's gonna show you the number of impressions and it's going to show you like over the daily ones and the average view duration, testing one versus the other. And then usually it's going to tell you at the top here, it says, based on the total number of impressions and clicks, 97% sure that the original will perform better than the variation. So this is the original, this was the variation that I had, so this tells me that I should stick with the original, which I did. So I hope that video was helpful, and um, we will come back in a bit and show you the difference and the results in my A-B test for the one that we created, which is going to be comparing this thumbnail against this thumbnail. Two weeks later, TubeBuddy is telling me that the variation, option B with my face in it, has a higher click-through rate and it is statistically significant, which means they have enough data to be sure about this. So they're saying that they are 96% sure the variation will perform better than the original. Therefore, I will stay with the variation. Other things to note are total views were higher with the variation and more importantly, browse features were double with the variation than the original. So therefore, I'm definitely sticking with the variation. YouTube does not offer true A-B testing. And even with this model, they do have to run usually one thumbnail for 24 hours and then the other for another 24 hours to get this type of data. But this is the closest I've seen so far from any provider. So keep in mind that A-B testing is a perk that is only on the legend version of TubeBuddy. So if you want a discount on TubeBuddy service, you can check out the description box and I'll also put it right here on the screen for a discount code for as long as you want to stay with TubeBuddy. I hope this answered some questions for you on how it's done. If you have additional ones, make sure you drop it in the comments and I will see what I can do to answer that question for you. As always, I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Thank you for spending your time with me. I'll see you in a video very soon. Bye guys. Which puppy do you think is cuter? We can't pick. We can't pick. They're both so cute. Mm -hmm. They're both so cute.